Hi, this is Dr. Heather Harrison. I'm a family physician at the Central Utah Clinic in Provo, and today we're talking about how to use spermicides for birth control. Spermicides basically means some sort of agent that's killing off the sperms, okay? When you think about like an insecticide or pesticide, what we're trying to do is kill insects or, spats, or pests. Spermicide is trying to make it so the sperm die off so they don't um, reach the egg and cause fertilization in a pregnancy. So spermicides, you can buy those just over the counter at the grocery store or pharmacy. You can get them in gels or foams or lubricants of some type. But what you need to do is make sure that you get those on in time. And they're usually used best in combination with a condom. So usually what I recommend is putting a condom on, putting spermicidal gel on inside the condom and even over the top of that. So when the sperm are released, they die off and don't make it to where you don't want them to go. Again, using a condom in combination with a spermicidal gel or foam will help to increase the efficacy up to about 80 to 90 percent for preventing pregnancy. Just using a spermicidal gel or foam alone is probably, you know, somewhere between 50 and 70 percent effective. So using in combination with a condom will help to improve the efficacy. Biggest thing again is make sure you get that on before the sperm is released. And then again, my preference is that they're inside the condom and on the outside of the condom in order to make sure the sperm, if they do make it outside of the condom, that they won't get up to the egg and cause uh, fertilization and a pregnancy that's undesired. Again, this is Dr. Harrison talking about the use of spermicidals.